how to give your old staircase a brand new look. In this video we will show you how to use our cladding system, so let's begin. So welcome to part one, I've got Marcin with me, our Marcin. Marcin will carry out the work on this sample staircase. So we have already started. The first step to uh, start renovation is to remove the overhang nosing. What we want to achieve is a square sort of finish. So I've got some materials down here. So behind Marcin we've got all the treads ready which will be cut to fit into that staircase. And what we want, because the treads, this, this style is called modern style, so we've got a riser which will go behind the tread, we want to remove that nosing. So uh, I'll let marching start and or continue to cut the nosings out. Okay, so we've got the nosing out and um, I will explain why we've done it. So our cladding system is designed to the riser, for the riser to go first. So as you can see it's nice and flush now to the, um, the old riser and the thread to overhang, overclad that riser here. Now if we, there's, two, there's also two, there's other way of uh, cladding, you can leave the nosings and add the piece of timber at the bottom just to level it but then what you've got to be careful is that your thread may come out or stick out from the stringer so by cutting the nosing out we allow that extra space and it all nicely fit in uh, within the stringers we also manufacture so the other type of thread uh, which is called a classic range uh, that's the modern range and that's the classic range. The difference is the difference is that nosing. So in the modern range we've got that nosing where visual effect is slightly different so you've got more thicker tread, more chunky tread compared to more slim uh, design. So uh, this only difference in the riser is if you was going to use a classic range the riser would have to be cut 2-3 millimeter higher to allow that space to actually go in into that groove. Very important part of this process is to make sure by the cutting the nosing out you do not weaken the strength of the staircase so it still remain rigid so you need to assess whether by cutting and removing that nosing the staircase is still rigid and sound. Okay, so what we do now, we've got a sample staircase, which is a quite new staircase, we just want to show how it works, but in most of the houses the staircase will be quite old and tired, so what we would recommend to do is find out what thickness of the riser is, drill, pre-drill some holes and put some extra screws for the strength of your staircase. Thanks for watching part 1. If you found it useful, please subscribe to our channel. All the links to the products we was using in this video are available in the comments area below this video. So, my name is Lucas and I will see you in the next part where we will explain how to do a stringer cladding which is that part there. See you next time.